Take a look at where you've been and how you've come so far No matter where you find yourself, you're always where you are Go anywhere you go, do anything you do, I'll be with you Take a moment, take an hour, take another year Hello, 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 my beautiful friends, my most special, amazing YouTube family. Welcome, everyone. I hope you are well, and I really wish to invite you for some painting session with me today. So many of you have been asking me, Marta, will you be doing Christmas cards, watercolor this year as well? And I was like, of course, yes. So I'm super happy, very excited that I can finally record this video. I'm using uh, something super awesome. I've used them last year as well. These are uh, Arteza uh, set of blank watercolor cards and envelopes as well. I think it's a great option if you maybe have no time, have spare budget and you wish to have cards just like that at you know from the box without measuring and all so here it is I'm gonna be using them uh, as last time I love this size as well it's pretty nice and big I have to say and I have been thinking what I'm gonna paint and um, I was thinking to do a little bit of a warm-up which means we're gonna do Christmas trees five ways of Christmas trees I thought it's gonna be a fantastic idea to try it out to start it's gonna be beginner level very simple very easy but also fun I hope you will join me. I'm very happy, super excited, but also quite nervous. I have to say, I haven't been watercolor in ages. I mean, far too long, so I'm a little bit nervous, so please stay with me. Paint with me, that's the main thing. I do have some cards, I have some watercolor gouaches here. Those are coming, let me show you, in tubes like that. Um, sizes of the sets are different, could be small, big, but you squeeze out uh, paints into those little containers and here they are. You can paint directly from those. I have also brushes here, I have water and I have plenty ideas to share with you. So please join me and let's paint together. I will be using some pencil to draw a little bit of a shape. All of our Christmas trees are going to be um, based on triangles. They're going to be different triangle shapes, uh, sizes and ideas of finishing them. I hope you can see my uh, sketch as well because it's quite important for me that you are able to see the actual sketch because sometimes when I sketch maybe too, too little. Now this is, uh, is it a stem? No, stem is for flower, isn't it? So this is more like a leg. So here is my first idea. I somehow have the feel for huge bubbles. So that's what I'm thinking to do, huge bubbles. And also I'm thinking to have some really awesome bubbles inside, quite big ones. Why not actually? Why not? So I'm thinking to like anything you only wish you can finish up however it feels good however it feels right to you but this is the first idea uh, let's grab some paints as well and um, I'm gonna grab also maybe a rubber and rub off a little bit of let me just rub off this a little bit so maybe it will be easier for some of you to actually follow up when those lines are gone there we go do you know what not to worry if things are not straight, if things are just not as you hoped. It's all about learning, it's all about experimenting, it's all about trying out. I have my paints here, but use whatever paints you have. I'm spraying my watercolor with some water, nothing special. I also made another kind of um, paint palette because I'm thinking it would be awesome to have greens especially uh, very much near each other if I need a little bit more of paint. So I was thinking to do um, a little bit of water going here around my bubbles actually around my bubbles just like this and hopefully I will be able to get some paint in there if I have any links for Arteza, I do have a link and I also have the coupon code as always. So for the links, check the description box 
below uh, if I have any other links that I can think of <laughs> during the video if I will have it it's gonna be it's gonna be there in the description box it's a very easy Christmas tree ideas and it's not about being super precise here and if you don't have watercolor um, paper try to use different uh, regular paper maybe try to do the same thing with just a regular paint why not to try that I'm gonna grab some green um, have, I don't know which green to grab and how about ooh, maybe a little bit of that maybe a little bit of this color green and a little bit of that that's lovely. Let's see. Let's see. Let's try it out. Mm. I'm gonna be just adding some color here and there, here and there, <laughs> trying out in different places. And afterwards, we will be doing uh, some doodles as well. So it's gonna be definitely adding up to our uh, project. So relax. Things are gonna be improving as we go and changing as well uh, with the actual addition of doodles, lines and all. So nothing to worry. Plus, as I said, I'm not a watercolor artist. I keep on saying that every single time I grab my watercolors. I always says I'm just learning like yourself. I'm here to teach you the way as it makes me happy. Uh, ideas that comes to my mind and different. Like I could not not come back to you this year with the Christmas cards. I was like Marta no matter what you have to come up with some ideas. You have to uh, do something. Not have to but I would love to. You would love to. Everyone else would love to. So why not to do that. So that's why I'm here with you. And Watercolors are so much fun and it's easy, accessible, it's good for kids as well, why not? So look, this is what we have um, we can actually leave this for drying for one minute. Grab another actually card, let me just grab it. Grab another card and draw when this will be drying and we can draw the other design. And the other design is going to be uh, slightly different because we will be using Two actual, um, two actual, um, oh, a lack of words from Marta. Two triangles. We're gonna be using two triangles. Here they are. Something like that. And also stem. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with me. I keep on forgetting and doing the the <laughs> top part very wide. I don't know why is that. <sighs> Oh, but that's okay, Marta. That's okay. Um, I also do feel like having a huge... All of my this year Christmas tree in this video are going to have this huge bubble inside. Then I have been thinking to do bubbles like here, kind of. Like, um, um, what's the word? Like, oh, I don't know, in English. You know, I'm, no, I know you know what I'm trying to say. So that's what I have been thinking to add to this design. I think it's super cute and super easy. You have to admit it. It is for everyone. I decided to make this video... Uh, I think we don't need this second layer here. I decided to make this easy video uh, with the trees only because I thought that for some people maybe trees is the maximum of their abilities. And you know what? Here they are, few few trees that you can use for your cards, uh, for your family, relatives, for your friends and all. There we go, how pretty. We're going to do exactly the same thing here, doing a little bit of painting, a little bit of sketching and going in between. Now I'm using some biggish brush which is great and helping as well. These are... These are round Nick Pro. I don't even know where I got them. If I, as I said, if I have any idea, I'm gonna let you know. Check Arteza for brushes. I didn't check if they have anything this year because I haven't been watercolor much, that much as last year. Maybe they have some new brushes. I do have them from last year. These are the cute little tiny watercolors that they have. Super nice, very pretty, um, very delicate, very small. Uh, bristles, great for details. So I'm pretty sure they must have some bigger sets as well. So have a look. The water is very dirty, so it's everything is pretty much green already. <laughs> That's okay, I don't mind that. Um, mm, I'm gonna grab... I'm gonna grab my my 
how about a little bit of that a little bit of that green a little bit of that green going on oh that's so nice it's nice and it's uh, do you know I'm not precise in coloring like I could be going very much um, trying to go in in there in those bub in between those bubbles it's okay look it's more like a relaxing sort of feel uh, I don't think it has to be it's like it's not coloring it's like it's just it's just us relaxing and doing a little bit of watercolor so there we go super and I'm trying to rush it in a way in a way just so you can see that you don't need much time to actually make your own cards you don't need huge skills to make them so here they are super easy super pretty as well once they finished wait till they finished because <laughs> they will be so much nicer now I am not a watercolor artist I wish someday maybe this year it's gonna be different and I will be able to do a little bit more with my watercolors I kind of abandoned them for the past months uh, things have been just different to all of us life has changed so much and things have changed uh, life is just surprising us and um, so yeah that's how things I think are just changing we are exploring we are going into different directions and so on so yeah I think it, it bound, 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 meant to be, I don't know how to say it, meant to be. So yes, I am thinking to do a little bit of adding of different shades in different places. No, there is no, <laughs> there is no such a thing as um, that I'm trying to do any sort of um, technique here. No, my technique is making sure you're going to try to paint. I really hope you will try to paint it I would love that okay so let's have this on that side let's leave this to dry and we are gonna be back to this one how about making the scrumptious red uh, scrumptious red bubbles I think we should I think we could do that I think it would be fantastic making scrumptious red bubbles there we go it is gonna be fantastic now question is are we doing all red bubbles or we are going to do uh, different colors. Uh, quick think, quick thinking. I don't know, I can't think. I'm thinking, 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 thinking. Uh, no, I'm gonna do them colorful. <laughs> I'm gonna do them colorful. So how about a little bit of blue now? How about that? We're gonna do a little bit of blue. There we go. Maybe here. Yes, let's go for the colors. Let's go for the colors. Now, if you don't have watercolors, you can use kids, 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 um, kids. Ah, I'm sorry, my English is gone this year. <laughs> you can use kids paints, of course, P poster paints, any kids paints, like anything you only have. Use whatever you have. Don't feel that you cannot do it because you don't have what I'm showing you in this video. It's just a suggestion what I have here. It's not necessity. It's not what what is gonna make you uh, paint better. <laughs> no, it's not. So ah, I'm, I have some gold here as well. How about a little bit of gold? Maybe on top. Wouldn't that be nice to do a little bit of top gold on top? How about that? Let's see. Oh. It's not as gold. Well, it is gold, but maybe not on white. <laughs> it would be probably nicer if it's not going to be on white, but it's lovely. Let's see another color. What else could match lovely here? Um, dum -da -da -dum. Let's try it. This is my favorite color in the world. Oh, I love how they actually, <laughs> how they actually purple went away there. I like that. I, I think it's actually nice. <laughs> I made the similar thing with the other bubbles. Okay, there we go. I think I'm gonna go back to red and have more reds just because it's Christmas and I think it's nice to have red more than other colors. At least that's what I'm thinking right now. <laughs> it may change. I'm gonna have this one here as well in red. Why not? And how about... No, I'm gonna actually grab that purple again. It's gonna be super nice. I believe. Oh, that green. That's okay. I'm gonna have this purple. Oh, it went really lovely there. I love it. 
um, for 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 some of you may may be like, oh no, it went there. Oh no, it mixed up. Oh no, that's okay. Relax. It's only paint going to its own direction. It's fine. Like. It's fine. I'm gonna grab this blue there as well and it's gonna be super pretty. Oh, I love it already. I mean, seriously, it is so pretty. So when it's dry, we're gonna do a little bit of... There we go. We're gonna do a little bit of... Um, or maybe brown stem. Will we do brown leg? We will do a little... Or maybe this color. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's nice. If I can, If I can find it. It was this one. And this one together, mm, like a mm, like a purple nearly. Um, so when this is dry, we will do um, we will do doodles and white, and everything will look so much different and hopefully better. <laughs> okay, let's grab this one back again, and I'm gonna be doing probably exactly the same thing because it is just perfect to do uh, colorful on here so I'm gonna grab the colorful oh no way no 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 okay oh well it is what it is I have to accept it it went its own way that's fine let's just have it like this <laughs> it's like as if the um, what's the word? Like fireworks nearly. That's okay. I should wait for it to dry better, but I didn't. So let's just have this one. Oh. Now what are we gonna do on top? I think on top we could have... It's nearly as if meant to be. <laughs> It's nearly as if meant to be. Uh, on top, I think, we could have also gold or super yellow, bright yellow. How is that? Super bright yellow. Let's try the yellow. Um, I do have a mm, very nice mixture here of... I have some clean water as well. So maybe this yellow. Oh, that's a nice yellow, although it's not that bright, but it's okay. I don't mind that. A little bit of that gold. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Here we go. It's a cute bubble on top of that. And I'm gonna, I think, leave this to dry. So let me show you them both from close. There we go. That's for now what we have. We need another base. Let's have a look there we go and card number three and uh, this time i'm gonna be doing three triangles three triangles and we will do quite of a similar bubble thing i have been thinking to do like really crazy big bubbles <laughs> like a lot of a uh, bubbles actually there we go and stem as well something like that I hope you could see that well there we go maybe I'm gonna swap my jars <laughs> for the clean one why not um so I am thinking to do a little bit of water going on there maybe I'm gonna grab some paint right away and just paint right away this time mm-hmm Something like this, I, I'd say. Also around the bubbles, go in. There we go. Uh, I think I can feel that I didn't paint for ages. It's like, they say that you don't forget these things, like what um, riding a bike. But you know what? <laughs> it takes a little moment from you to kind of grasp the idea and to be back to, uh, you know, feeling of, yeah, I know how to do it, I remember. I haven't touched watercolors in, wow, in, I think since, since February, it's nearly a year, wow, that's crazy, that's long, isn't it, I think that's super long, but oh well, it was that because of different sort of 
things, <laughs> I suppose. And I, I think many of you have the same, that you didn't play with watercolors for years and you like decides to do so now. Yeah, I think you should. I think we all should just grab it and just not worry about the consequences of outcome. Just see how it goes, maybe make few cards and see which is the best looking or not so best looking. I think that looks quite lovely, I have to say. I like that. So I'm going to put this aside and I have two more ideas of kind of similar but not, not that similar. We're going to grab a big triangle yet again and we're going to have... We're gonna have. Um, I was thinking to do the um, to do the circles like kind of. Oh yeah, the big bubble, of course, and it's like tiny circles. I have been thinking, but I'm now thinking that maybe without drawing, I can basically just grab. Let me just grab a different color, different green. Uh, what a mix, and I'm just thinking to do a different sort of style of um, of painting in terms of I think I'm just gonna be I'm just gonna be doing doodles when everything is dry with the maybe markers this time so for these I watercolor them but maybe for this one I'm just gonna go with the tiny markers because uh, it may be just a little bit more convenient. Oh, there we go. There we go. It looks pretty good to me. And we're going to have a little bit of that brown as well. That's a very much, I like that very much, like a regular, basic, good looking color to me anyway. And I'm going to put this aside if I can find another free side. <laughs> and lastly, I have been thinking to do like a lot of tiny actually, like tons of tiny, um, big bubble of course, tons of tiny triangles, like really a lot of them. Mm -hmm. Like obviously this Christmas tree may feel like it doesn't look like Christmas tree, that's okay. <laughs> and I'm gonna do exactly the same thing as I've done with the previous card. I think I'm also learning uh, myself how to make it more, um, I guess, efficient, not efficient is a bad word. <laughs> how to just make it um, more, mm, I don't know just easier to run so yeah I think that's just oh I love that I love that and I think I'm gonna just oh maybe you heard Lucas he's watching here TV uh, on the phone uh, earphones <laughs> oh, the husbands of youtubers <laughs> The husbands, oh, different color. The husbands of YouTubers, YouTube ladies, crafter ladies, especially, isn't it? Am I right? <laughs> the patience of a saint, I think, a lot of times it is. So, oh, it feels so good. I think I'm just so very, <laughs> so very much um, uh, loose hand because I'm just so enjoying today's watercolor because I didn't do it for like forever so I just kind of wish to be free like a bird and like yeah just go with the flow just however it feels good just paint <laughs> without you know without any sort of stress so yeah that's what I'm doing right now okay I think I'm gonna leave all of them to dry come back to you in for you it's gonna be five minutes for me it's gonna be a bit longer and I'll see you in a second. Back to you. Let's do a little bit of coloring painting. I have been thinking to do um, maybe using some markers or something but I think I'm gonna be super happy sticking to watercolors mostly. I just love it, watercolors and that's it. Um, I'm gonna be just grabbing different shades. I think I was just basically super nervous with the first <laughs> cards. I hope you can forgive me that. Um, let me know in the comments 
how many how long have you been away from your watercolors how long I just truly wonder that how long have you been not painting and do you plan on the watercolor with me this year I would love to hear from you here is my here is my question to you how long have you been away from watercolors look at it so cute I just think that my hand <laughs> with this card was just so shaky and oh well I hope I can still fix the other one I really hope that and what's what, what's uh, what else what next what what else maybe this one could be quite nice mm, yes I think so too and we can definitely add up this and some more. There we go. And here maybe even one there. Super. And I do believe we should have a little bit of that yellow on top. And that would be awesome. I do feel a little bit that these watercolor cards are like for kids. And you know what? That's okay. I think it's a great warm up, great trial of our abilities of getting to know the watercolors back again and going with something simple without expectations. I think I, I found that even my videos, the easiest ones, like the ones that I thought that they're too easy to post, are the ones that are actually the most uh, watched and also appreciated by, by everyone. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. I am just painting doing what I feel it could be super well super important super super mm, appreciated and used in the reality like um, making like difficult or great arts it's great but how many people will really use that idea and really like follow along not that many I think simple crafts like this one it's far more possibility that I'm gonna reach to those who really have never painted so if you are here for the first time hello and welcome in Marta's channel I love uh, basic tutorials for people I love beginner style I love uh, using what you have encouraging you to actually um, and I do chat a lot in the videos, as you can hear. And I love... Oh, that's so cute! So cute, so cute! Uh, and I love encouraging everyone to, to try to start to experiment, to not be afraid. So I hope you will join me and other crafters. Maybe you are not a crafter as such. Maybe it's your very first time. That's okay. I do chat a lot. You may love it. You may really don't like it. It's super awesome personal thing as well. I don't know. <laughs> Many people enjoy it and find it therapeutic when I chit chat about everything and nothing. Um, yeah, so <laughs> however it feels good to you. Mm, but I hope you will stay for longer. Maybe subscribe to my channel and enjoy more videos coming. I'm going to be doing a little bit of different things this year. I have two videos that I have never done for Christmas. I've done so many Christmas videos that for me it's a little bit difficult to come up with new ideas in terms of having, you know, really thinking of ideas that will people will follow and really truly enjoy and all. So yeah, quite interesting if you think about it. That's a very tiny Marta. That's like cheating, but okay, let's leave it. This is super cute, too cute actually, I have to say. And we're gonna have the big yellow bubble. I don't know, I'm for bubble this year, not for stars. I don't know why. <laughs> I really don't know why, but I just love it. It's just different. So we have bubble and we have one more card to paint. The rest is keep on drying. And this one I have been thinking as well. I'm gonna do bubble first. This one I also thought about having the little dots and all. Let's see. And this doesn't really look realistic, is it? Or, or maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it is actually looking realistic. But I have been thinking to do like on the on here because other trees don't have that so why not have this on the on the edges as well as well as in the ins on the inside of course 
-hmm. Now we will do uh, we will do add. <laughs> we will do add. We add as well, of course. Um how about this blue here? We will add as well um, white, which will make a huge, huge, huge difference, huge change for the project. You will see it for yourself. If you're not too sure what to do next, grab a white. It usually ha helps in kind of outlining and just, yeah, adding up to the project. So try it out. It should help, usually does. It really does now. And I think, color-wise scheme, it could be cute and nice if we're gonna jump in with just this yellow, bright yellow, although I don't know if it's gonna be that very much visible on our on our tree. Let's see. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe. I'm gonna add white anyway, so this is gonna be our a striking point the white added up okay super awesome let's check the cards if the rest of them are dry not so much I'll be back everything is dry time to do a little bit of doodles that's what I love the most I have to say now I am not precise here I'm just going around I am going with the like it nearly sketching sort of attitude to my yeah to my card as if this meant to be all of it because it did meant to be <laughs> but if someone has any doubts here it is you can show them that you know all of that pretty meant to be there we go. How cute is this? I mean, very much pretty, very much cute. Now you can go around with a little bit of um, white. You can also do a little bit of a little bit of coloring, maybe even more if you wish like it. Now, how awesome! How cute! How pretty! I totally, totally love it. I think it's super super awesome and how different it looks let me show you when you have doodled and not so doodled card isn't it so let's keep on doodling um, let's see I'm gonna be going I have to kind of move my I think the faster the looser hand is um, I think it's just easier I guess otherwise when you think too much it's just not happening there we go it is just then kind of I think harder I'm, I think I'm more confident when I'm like <laughs> uh, I think I love the idea of at the end of this kind of like a signature thing <laughs> I don't know <laughs> the kind of I don't know I don't know um, how different can we do it? Look, what you could do is you could go with a little bit of some dots and have them all dotted. How cute is this? Super cute. And you can see how different, how it changes when it really is, when it really is completed with the doodles. It changes everything, isn't it? It really does change a lot. So here is card number two. Super cute, super pretty. Let's see if we can rescue this one. I know, I know <laughs> it was a little bit of, oh, what's going on here, but that's okay. Let's see, let's see if we can actually uh, make it pretty, prettier. <laughs> let's call this one uh, an accident while working and learning the watercolors. And you know what? I could edit uh, edit out this bit, this Christmas tree, and pretend it never happened. But no, I'm okay to show it to you. I'm okay to show the weaknesses, the not so great project, not so great idea. Well, idea is great. <laughs> Just my way of doing it was like, what's going on? Um, but you could see, 
how things are happening, when they are happening, and why and all. I think it's not too bad, not too bad. Let's see if we can do even something extra, if we can do a little bit of, a little bit of, um, what can we do? I think we could do a little bit of, like, maybe some dots going where the, where the, this is going. I don't know in English. Uh, Wine so in Polish. <laughs> in English, I don't know. Uh, we could have, it's like little berries hanging, isn't it? I think like little tiny berries. Super cute. I like that. I love it. Although it's not perfect, but who is perfect? Tell me these days who is perfect. I think it's super lovely. Um, yeah, I think we we'd be happy with that. We could go over with the green and paint it over, but that's okay. Um, let's have a look at this one now. Yet again, we're gonna jump in with the free hand, like run, run, and then I'm gonna try to go with this one. I think practice makes so difference in all, whether it's art, whether it's cooking, it's all down to practice, my friends, because really, the more you do it, the better you become, the more confident. Same with the doodles, I'm like, with each card, it's like more and more confident, feeling better and better, and yeah, I can do it, I can do it, I can do it, I love it, I love it. Let's have this circle, this, like, don't overthink anything, and if something is just not the best, or mm, you're not so sure, keep on going, don't give up. You know, I think someone will appreciate it. People who will receive your card, handmade card, will really truly appreciate your trials. Um, yeah, so you can do it. I promise. Ah, so cute, so cute, so cute. And the new people that are joining this channel are gonna thinking, no, I'm not subscribing to this weirdo. She's singing in her videos. I mean, seriously. Yes, I am sometimes when I'm happy when when things are happening when I'm making video that I'm so proud of and also excited to share. I'm always excited, but sometimes I oh, I'm overly excited. <laughs> I I'm very happy obviously and just happy happy. I'm thinking, look. This is nice idea. Oh. Hannah would say that. Hannah my 3 and a half year old. Oh, mama, <laughs> that's so cute. So I think that is so cute. And how about trying to fix this one as well? Maybe if we do a little bit of, oops, some lines or something. Something, something. There we go. That will do. <laughs> and lastly, lastly, oh by the way, if you're wondering, the black one is, the black pen is Fudable from Kuretake, from Kuretake Ohto. Is it Kuretake? No, it's not. Sorry. It's Ohto. Is it Kuretake? It's Japan anyway. Japanese. Anyway, I'll leave you the link. Of course, I will. Okay, let me just have a run with this one. Oh, it's all about bubbles this this year, I think. <laughs> I already actually got something for outside the house and it's bubbles. Um, I'm very excited about that. I, I like to get something every year, kind of. Uh, something that match, will match the rest. Oh, I forgot about bubble there. Will we do the bubble there? I think we could, because why not? Let me just grab the, the brush. And the uh, uh, orange, yeah, Marta, well done. Oh well, is it orange? It is. Okay, it is. So I'm gonna grab the red instead. Oh, that rhymed. Red instead. Okay, I'm gonna grab this one. Mhm. Mm and hopefully this will dry within a few minutes, unless I'm gonna touch it <laughs> and destroy it. But look how the black 
outlining makes an awful difference like seriously I'm in I, I'm drawing in in the in the air because I do not want to <laughs> touch that red imagine this now um so here it is even double the lines um yeah I like that I love that actually let me see if I can quickly Quickly, quickly, quickly. It's happening. It is happening. It is happening. Okay, how about... I wanted to do dots, but then I thought, no. This is good as it is. I still think we're going to do some splashes, guys. Because white splashes, or green splashes, or any sort of splashes are a must, I think. Okay, to make it faster, <laughs> there we go, there we go, as if she was there, always, ooh, and my pen is red, I need to clean it off quickly, 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 off the side, there we go, okay, wow, love this, love this so much, so much, now, we could do a little bit of this, a little bit of a little bit of like a snow effect nearly like white on the on the actual I think this um, not so good Christmas tree doesn't look that bad after all <laughs> I think we are kind of done here we have five Christmas trees ready let me show you them from this Okay, here they are. I have to say these three are my absolute favorite. I think you can definitely take a lot from these three. These two less favorite, but I like them. I think they're just looking super cute together. So my friends, I hope this warm up was inspirational and fun to do. Let me know in the comment section down below if you enjoyed this video and also if you would like more of these videos. I'm gonna also uh, give you links to all the previous watercolor card making videos we can see from previous years because they are super cute super fun super pretty and I think it's worth to see them so without um, um, going any further I'm gonna wrap up at that wishing you a lovely time I know it's early for Christmas videos but I think some of you may be really really hoping and wishing to start painting now so here they are more to come I hope uh, let me know if you would like to see them thank you so very much as always I love you but I do have to go till the next time happy painting and I'll chat to you super, super very soon. Bye! Bye-bye!